Podcast 5, Defining Success. Awaken the leader inside. Follow the path of leadership. Never give up. Never stop trying. Get up. Believe in yourself. Not every day is going to be easy, but you've got to challenge yourself. You need courage. Be ready. Stop waiting for it to happen. Go make it happen. Harness the power within. You are destined to be a leader. Follow the path of leadership. Awaken the leader inside. Podcast 5 defining success. Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Dave Rubakava and I'm your host here at Awaken the Leader Inside. Today's topic is probably the least understood uh, component to being a leader and I think that's defining what success is. And so it's such a gray area and it's such, um, it, there's so many variations to what we believe success is. I'm going to share with you what I believe success is because, you know, we all categorize it by monetary, how much money we're finally making, or it could be getting to that next position. Some people define success as feeling happy, feeling uh, proud and accomplished. So there's so many variations to what success is, but I think it's it's important that I share how I feel how success is measured because I spent a lot of time early in my career on the other side of not feeling successful. And so as I started to progress in my career, I started to kind of really pay attention to the small wins in my life and the small wins in my career. And, and when I made small uh, you know, improvements in my leadership and now looking back 16, 17 years later, I, re I realize now that there was measurable moments in my career where I was actually successful and I didn't really realize it yet or I didn't understand it yet. And so what does that mean? That means as you're looking at different components of your career and different components with uh, leadership development and growth, there's something that I think we fail to look at and it's the small steps of success. People ask me, people have asked me a lot, so David, how do you define success or do you feel like you're successful? Um, I define it as whenever there is a moment where you feel there is an opportunity for you to fail and you come through it. Let's say, I'm going to give you an example. Let's say uh, you are given a challenge to deliver some type of result that you have never experienced before, that you have never had that level of responsibility on your plate. And you say, you know what, I'm going to do it. I'll take on that responsibility. And you come through, even though it's probably the most stressful time uh, working on this project and you're not sleeping and you're not eating, but you know what, you find a way to deliver those results and they are excited about your results. That is a small win. That is a small win that clearly defines that you are being successful maybe with that specific uh, you know, project or specific time. And I'll give you another example. There's times when you feel like you're failing and you look in the mirror and say, you know what, I got to change. I got I to gotta find another solution. I got to find someone that can help me. Those moments where you start to turn the corner and see that you can make a difference, that you can change yourself and you can grow, that's success too. And so there's so many levels of things that we do that we, we, we always looking for the end result. And I think the hardest thing for people to understand is that as you're growing as a leader, it's not really about the end result. It's about your journey because your journey is going to strengthen you. Your journey is what's going to make you stronger. All those setbacks, how you've learned from them and you grow from them and then you don't make them anymore. Those are the things that I think when I look back on my even my own career that I was building success slowly but surely month after month, year after year. I was getting stronger. I was continuously learning. I had setbacks and I would rally back from a setback even stronger. To me, success is defined by you overcoming a challenge in whether it's operational, whether it's your personal leadership style, whether it's team building, whenever you are overcoming some significant challenge where you feel that you are struggling and you can overcome that, that is success. Now you do that through attrition and over time, 
you will start to build an amazing career. You will start to climb the ladder. You will start to enjoy things like promotions, the monetary compensation, and all those great things that come along with it. They will be there. But if that is your only focus, you're going to miss the thing that's the most critical about being a leader, and it's your ability to grow and to learn from your mistakes. You know, sometimes I think back on my career, and I think back even while I'm teaching and coaching and training new leaders, I realize I felt the most successful when I was at peace with knowing where I'm at as a leader, with knowing that I can overcome anything. And yeah, it might be challenging. Yeah, I might have a bad month or a bad you know, week, or maybe I fall behind on a project, but I'm gonna, I know that I can get the job done. I know that I can go out and execute, and maybe I have to really refocus and look at what part of my leadership is failing me right now. I'm okay with that, and I'm comfortable with that. And I think that is where I feel like I've become successful uh, because I am not afraid of any challenge that's put in front of me. I'm not afraid to, to challenge my leaders to grow in the same capacity. And I feel successful because I see them grow and find their own level of success. So for everyone, success is different. And don't get caught up in somebody else's version of success, whether, like I said, it's uh, the promotion, the this, the that. I mean, there's, all that stuff is going gonna, is gonna to happen through time. You have to be happy with you. You have to be comfortable with your leadership. You have to be comfortable knowing that you can accomplish anything as long as you challenge yourself to do it. That's how you find success. Success comes from within. It's not a role. It's not money. It's not any of that stuff. It's your ability to overcome any challenge and be confident. That's what I think success really comes from is your confidence and ability to overcome anything that's put in your way. So I hope that makes sense. Think about things in your life. Think about things in your career. And think about all the great things you've done. And don't dismiss that. Don't dismiss what you've done just because you're not at a certain stage or you're not at that certain position yet. Because if you do that, you're going to lose the thing that's the most important. And that's keeping your morale high. Don't get caught up in what everyone else is doing. Be happy with you. Be happy with your progress. And someday you will kick down the door and you will find the success you've been looking for. So please, share your comments. Let me know how you feel about that. Let me t share with me your success stories. I hope to hear from you soon. Stay tuned for the next podcast. Always remember, awaken the leader inside.